How? Hi, everyone. <laughs> Letty here with this beautiful place, Tarot. How's everybody doing today? Today's reading is going to be who is lurking and creeping on you? <laughs> Mainly social media, but you know, people lurk and creep in a number of ways. Shouts out to my girl Haley with the Mystic Adventure Tarot. She asked me to do this reading. I've been putting it on my Instagram. What readings do you want me to do? So um comment down below whatever readings you want me to do i'll try to do them next is my girl k uh, i'm gonna do your reading next so yeah let's see um pile one will be the black cat pile two will be the orange pumpkin who is lurking and why i've been watching a lot of scary movies <laughs> oh Archangel Michael, Archangel Gabriel, ancestors, Ama, Apa, Abuelos y Abuelas, only benevolent, only good spirits are to be here. No malefic, no truth of spirits, and no demons. No weapon from the against me shall prosper. Exodus 14, 14. The Lord will fight for me. All I need to do is be still. Um, hmm, let me sit in the energy for a minute. Pile one, I feel like you need to do a lot of protection. Um... A lot of banishing is also what I'm hearing. You might be lighting a lot of candles right now. You know, I've been talking about this. You know, the veil being very thin. Um, some of y'all are also talking to deceased loved ones. I'm hearing somebody here is a medium. Um, pile one, I'm getting that this could be another psychic, another tarot card reader who's lurking on you. Somebody could be astro projecting to you. I had a dream this morning, y'all, and I was dreaming of 300. And I woke up with him saying, this is Sparta. So I'm getting told that this is relevant for your reading, Pile 1. Somebody could have been like, I don't know, like a gladiator or some shit for Pile 1. I don't know. Um, Yeah, so I woke up. That's what I heard. I woke up late today. Personal readings are going on. If you need a personal reading, guys, $50 for either 10 questions pre-recorded or face-to-face. -face. Mm. You might be needing a lot of sage, a lot of smoke cleanses. Get out in nature, touch a tree, hug a tree. You might need to surround your house with white light and salt is also what I'm hearing for Pal One. So yeah, this this is feeling like a bruja or brujo. Let's see, let's see. I'm gonna just use different cards that I'm called to. <clears throat> Who is lurking on pile one? I'm hearing mystic here. So that could be your name or that could be this person's name, a mystic. Archangel Michael, please. Who is lurking on pile one, the black cat? Pile one, they might be doing stuff against your crown chakra. Let me put on my hoodie. I have a hoodie on. I got a Bears hoodie on. The Bears have been doing great. Do y'all like football? I've been watching the Bears lately with my guy. They've been doing really good. Um, yeah. Something about crows, too. You could be seeing crows. They might be doing something against your crown chakra so that you're not trusting your intuition. This could also be a, a narcissist I'm hearing who gaslit you. Okay. Yeah, teacher in the reverse. This is somebody who's a false teacher. I'm getting hierophant energy here. Bottom of the deck, femme fatale in the reverse. That means I'm only reading the shadow. Give me one in the middle, spirit. Who is this? This could be a feminine. This could be another uh, witch I'm hearing. Could be a warlock, right? If you call yourself a warlock. Prostitute, damn. <laughs> prostitute damn this is somebody who is a shapeshifter i'm getting told take it this is somebody who may have like a only fans or i just heard body dysmorphia here give me a second guys a lot's coming in body dysmorphia we're gonna find out the t on this person because um somebody might do something for only fans no no shade you know however y'all make your money but prostitute isn't the light attribute Um, they might be doing something against your protection. I do a lot of stuff for protection, y'all. I have protection over protection for me and my daughter and my man. 
Somebody could be trying to do something to your car or your vehicle, I'm hearing, pile one. Protect your cars and your vehicles. Um, you might need to do a mojo bag. Give me, give me two more spirit, please. Archangel Michael, who is this? Who is lurking and creeping on pile one? Somebody just upgraded their car. They could have had like a Toyota and now they got like a Benz or Mercedes. Y'all know the way I feel about that, you know. <laughs> My daughter and me were just talking about Teslas this morning. We we're like, those cars are so fucking ugly. And then those, um, those cyber trucks. <laughs> Shouts out to Tyler Taro. He got that cyber truck. I'm like, that motherfucker's so ugly, that fucking car. With a hundred K, you could have bought you a, a Range Rover or something better. I don't know. Give me two. <laughs> yeah, monk nun under prostitute. This is somebody who is a people pleaser. This is somebody who tries to present to their community that they're really good, but they're not. This is also a fake reader, I'm hearing. Um, somebody who is in their dark and their light. Spirit wants me to correct that. They're, they're somebody who's in their dark and they also work out of their shadow. Bottom of the deck, bully. Yeah, this is a bully, pile one. This is somebody who like tries to get people to go against you. Um, to be like, oh, she ain't all that. She's not pretty, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> obviously i am if you keep coming to my fucking social media bitch and i got you blocked and you got me blocked right but you still energetically i know because i pull cards i know you're still in my shit right come on now bully this is a fucking bully um this is somebody who has tried to get their community to turn against you um, I'm hearing, if this is a feminine, she does this all the time. I'm hearing. She does this at work even. Bitches don't like her. They don't fuck with her. Her friends don't like her. She could have left her friends out in the cold and, like, left their shit out on, on the corner in the front of her house or some shit. I don't know. Um, somebody here, if this is a woman, I'm getting told she's very dirty. She's very unkept. Something about her mother telling her to clean her room. So this woman don't got her shit together. She could be doing only fans, and then her friends be like, uh, why, why does your room look like shit? I'm getting a channel message. Thank you, spirit. I love, love, um, Cosmic Royal Family, Mystic Beauty. She calls these hoes, these Jezza hoes, she calls them, uh, crunchy panty hoes. That's, that's what I'm getting here. These are crunchy panty hoes. You know, the bitches that don't do their dishes. They got to pour bleach on their dishes. They don't, you know, wash their dishes. That's that's who this is. And my dishwasher's going. And I also got um, Sade playing in the back. You can't hear it, but this uh, No Ordinary Love is playing. <clears throat> Let me drink some coffee, y'all. I love, love coffee mugs, you know, so I always got my man's coffee mugs. Something about a Dusty and a coffee mug or a hydro mug here, pile one. Um, you know, Dusty's buy you mugs. Real man providers buy you diamonds. I don't know who needs to hear that, but somebody here, they're attracted to a Dusty or a Dusty ass bitch. Because femme fatale is in the reverse and teacher's in the reverse. And that's the energy I'm getting here if this is a feminine. If this is a masculine, this is a bully too. They don't stand up for themselves. They listen to women. Women run them. Ooh, their mother runs them. You know, it's fascinating when you sit down and talk to a man's mom. <laughs> what the mom will tell you. Fascinating. <clears throat> Shouts out to my man and his family. If y'all see, seen, we just came from um, South Carolina. His mom reached 85 years old. I love his family, man. His family, they're so sweet. I just wanted to say that on camera, y'all. Um, yeah, pile one. This this is a shapeshifter. So a shapeshifter is anybody, anyone, obviously, who can walk into a room, be one way with one person, be some way with other, with other people. That's why I don't like groups, y'all. Because you see, you see real quick how people act in groups versus one-on-one -on -one versus two-on-one -on -one and three-on-one. 
you you see how people's body language changes something about this person's body they're not happy with the way they look all right let's get some more tea let's do all uh, the ones that are in the reverse femme fatale shadow inappropriate use of sensuality attachment to money and power yeah something about um men give this bitch money they're saying to me like she thinks people are loaded with money this is a karmic feminine she's a karmic in somebody's life she's a false teacher shadow attribute manipulating or abusing students teaching negative traits and destructive skills yeah people find out though they if she, if she has had friends she don't keep them for long i'm hearing she don't keep her friends for long she um damn a lot's coming through about this woman spirit damn um smooth operator is playing now across to north and south to Key Largo. Love for sale. As I'm about to read prostitute. Love for sale. So yeah. This, this girl tries to like get guys out of their money. Accentuates the challenge of surviving. Without negotiating the power of your spirit. Places material consideration. And security above self empowerment. Let's make sure y'all can read the cards. Okay. I have a lot of cards around me right now, guys, because I've been doing readings ever since I got back from um, from South Carolina. Thank you, guys. I've, I've been booked and blessed. Thank you. I appreciate y'all. If y'all want a reading, hit me up, beautifulplacetarot at gmail.com. Or hit me up on uh, Instagram. Okay, let's find out the tea on who this is. Who's creeping on your social media? Uh, this person thinks that you don't know that they're on your social media, but look. I like laughing at my haters. I'd be like, hey, bitch. Hey, ho. <laughs> I don't fuck with you. <laughs> you little dusty ass bitch. I don't fuck with you. Yeah, this person is definitely lurking. Who is this spirit? Give me three. Show me. This is a um, vibe about it. Graffiti deck. I love this deck, y'all. Love this deck. This is a great deck. If y'all don't have it, get it. If you're a reader. Because this definitely gives you the tea a simp bitch who's looking at your shit this is a, a karmic couple this is a simp this bitch has simps on her social media she could do like a like a fake lifestyle page air quotes or like a um like a health and fitness page that's all bullshit y'all it's just it's just a way for bitches hoes to show their body H have y'all noticed that on social media i, I go to the gym right <laughs> i go to the gym these bitches got their tripods out and stuff just so they could show their titties and their ass. That's all it is. This is a simp. This bitch has simps. Doing too much for someone, going overboard. So I'm hearing here, there's a card in here, right? And it says loaded. That's the card they're showing me in my mind's eye, guys. It says loaded. So this chick who's lurking on your shit and by the way she is doing magic on you i just want y'all to know that something about like cars or something to stop your forward move movement um she's she's got like simps she's got like dusties around her people who are flossing for the gram flossing for social media but don't really have it men that live at home with their mothers and women just to have a place to stay this woman could be like that too. She, like I said, something about living with her mom. I don't know. Her mom is coming through telling her to clean her room or something. Or like stop taking pictures when her fucking mirror is all dirty. I don't know. Bottom of the deck. Overindulgence. Yeah. Too much. Too fast. And I'm hearing loaded. I keep hearing, hearing loaded. This person has broken thinking. Settling for less than what you deserve. Dirty offer. What I say about being dirty? Spirit told me, turn the card over. Dirty offer. A naughty secret, a secret affair. This is a couple, too, for some of y'all. This could be a couple. Like a simp and his, his bitch, his femme fatale. Cock blocking. Yeah, they're telling me, keep going. 
hindering a connection. This bitch did magic to get this simp, and he still don't love her. He still don't want this bitch. I've been watching a lot of uh, old movies, y'all. And my daughter and me, we were watching, well, what is it? Belle and Candle with Jimmy Stewart. It was so good. It's about a witch who, who um, she doesn't like his girlfriend. So she puts a spell on him so he could fall in love with her. And then she ends up falling in love with him. But she has to tell him, like, I put a spell on you. So he gets mad, obviously. So this bitch did magic for a dude and he still don't love her. He still don't give her um, fidelity, they're telling me. Cock blocking, hindering a connection. Give me one in the middle, spirit. This could be a man, too, who has broken thinking. They overindulge. They spend their money. They're having a secret affair. Somebody who's trying to cock block you now because you're happy. Now you're in a new relationship, I'm hearing. You're happy you're, you're about to get married or you are married give me um give me one more spirit in the middle please i'm gonna cut the deck thank you archangel michael thank you for being here and protecting me amen smoke and mirrors misleading and embellishing so she does glamour magic she does glamours and only sims fall for glamours i've talked about that many times on here She's a nurse, refusing treatment, prolonging pain or abuse, in denial about health issues. So if this is a man, this man has an STD, I'm getting told. And I talked about it in my last video. Y'all need to go get your, your checkups, man. Smoke and mirrors. This could be a nurse. It's so funny when there's other readers that could pick up on good energy, man. Cult, this could be a cult strains and sinister twisted beliefs this is a cult that's looking at your shit they're they're looking on your shit a cult could be like three people y'all in agreement in my in my book that's like a cult of fucking losers of fucking monkeys flying monkeys right the simp the bitch and her brother or her mother <laughs> there you go you got a fucking cult but see i put my ancestors on an altar and I put their ancestors on an altar, too. Yep. <sighs> Smoke and mirrors. Misleading and embellishing. Yeah, this, this person, like I said, like, if they're in the gym, if this is a man in the gym, they're, like, got their tripod out, right? The fuck out of here, man. This chick, she's, like, showing her titties and her ass. We, we get it. You're a whore. We get it. <laughs> you like simps on your shit your man has no no respect we get it these are whores that don't get wife we we get it it's okay you'll get you'll get a self-esteem in the next lifetime smooth operator is still playing sade maximum joy give me one more who is the spirit give me the tea on this bitch Dirty offer. I'm getting told that somebody's burning out here. Somebody's burning out here. Dirty offer. Somebody got an STD or this bitch might be a Jezebel spirit. Behavioral issues. Hostile and antisocial. So these people can't even be around others because they don't know how to act. Bottom of the deck, I'm getting told. Smooth talker. Look at as I'm telling you, smooth operator is playing. Deceptive words to trick. This is a trickster. This is a shapeshifter. This is a people pleaser. They do stuff for their community. Smooth operator. Deceptive words to trick. Persuasive, charming, dangerous. That's who this is. Somebody could be Asian here, I'm hearing. Or Latino, you know, Latinos, we're, we have Asian descent. Give me, um, give me one more spirit. Give me one more. Sheeple follows the crowd, easily influenced. What I say, this is a people pleaser. I, I make nothing up, y'all. Anything I say, the cards back me up. Exposed. Truths are being revealed, uncovering. They don't like you because you've uncovered them. You could have a platform. You could be a tarot card reader. This person could have betrayed you with this Jezebel. Betrayed, violated by intentional actions. They could have betrayed you. This is a prostitute, a bully, a false teacher. 
a shapeshifter, a false monk or nun, and a femme fatale. They're using their bodies. My body all over your body, babe. Give me one more. <laughs> I love this deck. Give me one more, Archangel Michael. Entanglements. Third party, outsiders, messy. Busy bodies, a web of lies. What'd I say? This is a narc and his flying monkey. Or monkeys. That's who's lurking on your shit. Pile, uh... Pile one. Y'all be knowing this shit, though. Especially if y'all are intuitives. Y'all are readers. What's up to my other readers? Shout out to my girl Rose with the Abyss Tarot. These are her cards. We're going to use them. Soul Seasons Tarot. These are beautiful cards, too. Especially now during uh, pumpkin season. Do y'all like pumpkin spice? Five of Swords. Hoodwink. Yeah, Five of Swords is that tit for tack energy. This is an Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. First card out is the strongest in Tarot. They're telling me take it the empress look at this i can't make this shit up this is an air sign and a taurus did y'all see how how spirit stopped me from shuffling where my other tarot card readers at i've seen other readers their fucking cards go flying when spirit wants a card out five of swords tit for tat energy win at all cost energy the empress taurus libra energy that's who this is that's who's on your shit lurking <laughs> hey haters what's up haters what's up <laughs> they're trying to block your happiness your forward movement like i said before that shit only works on dusties that shit don't work on defined feminines it don't work go back to the drawing board okay yeah entanglements yeah this is a third party situation here fifth party six parties if this is a man he can't he can't you know control his cock where he puts his cock if she's this a bitch she don't close her legs she fucks everybody i just heard she's a cum bucket damn that's definitely one of my ancestors they call her a cum bucket somebody got like frizzy ass hair like this like reddish frizzy hair i think that's her mom her mom got frizzy ass hair i don't know something about frizz buster i'm hearing Give me one more. Who is this, please, spirit? Oh. All right. Queen of Cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. They didn't even want me to shuffle. Look at that. Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You're an intuitive. You're in the collective. I love intuitive Kev. He's always like, hi, boo. Hi, babe. <laughs> hey, love. <laughs> I love when he does that. Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, this is about legacy, inheritance, wealth. Look at the way they just they just pop out. Look at look at. I love it. I love when spirit does that. Like here, I want these motherfucking cards out. Okay, spirit, I hear you. Legacy and wealth. Queen of Cups. You're an intuitive. Look at that. What's up, my other tarot card readers? Haley, what's up? Yeah. That's why they're doing this against you. They don't want you to come into your gifts. They don't want you to have all your clears. They don't want your platforms to be successful. Guess what, bitch? You ain't stopping nothing over here. Here, nothing over here. He, all right, all right. Let's get the vibe. Let's get the vibe. Who is this? <laughs> Although I, I know very well who my haters are. I know very well who they are. I know all the tea on them. All the tea. Talk to their mama. Talk to their fucking best friends. Their ex best friends. Talk to their coworkers. They be like, oh, he ain't shit. She ain't shit. <laughs> Give me three. Give me three. Archangel Michael. Give me three. Who is this? Longing. Missing you. Let's talk. Reunion. Yeah, these motherfuckers want to come back and talk to you. They miss your energy, especially if you're a queen of cups. Keep in mind, guys, you know, it doesn't matter about your sign. This is an archetype. Queen of cups is intuitive, psychic, loving, kind. They hold down their family. They hold down their kids missing you let's talk reunion uh no bitch i'm good <laughs> go back with that prostitute go back with that cock blocking hoe with that jezebel spirit with that crunchy panty uh bitch who's in the gym taking pictures all fucking day showing her titties and her ass i don't i don't know how anybody's man is cool with that i really don't my man would my fiance i should say would not be no he would be like uh-uh uh-uh <laughs> no 
hopeless, lost, depression, suicide. This person's hopeless. They may even be projecting this shit onto you. They want you to be hopeless like them. Now, bitch, Archangel Michael. Look at this. Y'all hear me knocking? Y'all know that's who I channel. Y'all know that's who I got a tattoo of, right? That's my ace boon coon. Protection, prevented from harm, divine intervention. Look, what I say, they want to project this onto you. These people, I don't know if y'all ever did generating, um, what is that, human design? These people cannot generate their own light. That's why Archangel Michael is around you. Yeah, they're toxic. Look at drama, arguments, incompatible. And there's a siren going off. Archangel Michael is here. Thank you. Thank you, Archangel Michael, for protecting me. And the collective who calls on you. Thank you. Toxic, drama, arguments, incompatible. That's who this is. Give me one more, please. Archangel Michael. That's who this is that's doing this. They're longing for you. They miss you. They can't generate their own energy. Comment down below. Let me know what you are in human design. If you've taken the test, I've, I've taken the test. <sighs> Give me one. Archangel Michael. Who is this? Who's creeping? Y'all like that Dracula, uh, that Dracula thumbnail? Yeah. I've been watching a lot of old movies in Dracula. I'm like, what the fuck is up with these lights on his eyes? He's so creepy. I want to suck your blood. Miss Mia. <laughs> what else I've been watching? Uh, Vincent Price, The House on Haunted Hill. That was really good. I saw Christine the other night. I love, I love Stephen King, y'all. If you know me, I love reading Stephen King. Me and um this chick were talking about him at my um my cousin's party, his books. Yeah, I'm a nerd. I'm a nerd. Give me one, Archangel Michael. Thank you. Tension, stressed out, migraines, worry. Yeah, this person's worried. They're worried. They've done spell work on you. That shit's all going back. You do spell work on me, on my family, on my man, it's all going back, return to sender. All going back, return to sender with a bow, with a kiss. Ah, there you go. Chef's kiss. There you go. Archangel Michael is going to make sure of it. I know it. I know it. My ancestors will too. You're highly protected, pile one, because I started talking about protection magic. You're highly protected. Black cats. Black cats. You might have a familiar too who watches over you. Smell the roses, slow down, take some time, get out in nature. Yeah, you definitely have to ground and clear. Um, also practice gratitude. I want to take this time to tell the universe, tell God, tell Archangel Michael, all my archangels, my ancestors, my spirit guides, that I deeply, deeply appreciate them on camera. Thank you. I love you guys. My mom, my grandma, you know who you are, who protect me, who watch over me. Thank you so much. Amen. And on that note, boundaries. Yep. All right, pile one. That's who this is. That's who this has been. Like, share, subscribe to my channel. Um, Who's creeping? Who's lurking? We already know. It's an air sign. It's a Taurus. It could be a water sign or that could be you. Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. We have everything out here but fire, but they're definitely working with like a coven, a cult, their mother, their brother, to try to send you shit. Like I said, that only works on simps, boo. That shit only works on simps. It don't work on divine feminines. People who have uh, a calling on their life, readers who are in their north node, who help the collective. Also, let me say this, October was Domestic Violence Awareness Month. Definitely uh, comment down below, email me if you are in a in a bad situation and you need help getting out because I'm getting told somebody right now is watching me. You you could be living with a narcissist, I'm getting told. So you're gonna reach out, I already know that. My spirit guide already showed me you, so. Hit me up, beautifulplacetarot at gmail.com, okay? Cause tarot is very, very empowering. Very empowering, especially to divine feminines, y'all. Especially divine feminines. All right. I love y'all. Take care. What up, Haley? I love you, Haley. Thanks for recommending this. By going on to pile those. Pile two. I am not reusing this card, spirit. All right. Let's, let's, let's keep it going. 
I'm hearing let's keep it together. Can we keep it together? I don't really want to go, but I really want to know. Can we keep it together? Um, my shed, my Sade shut down. Give me a second. y'all love Sade? I love Sade. Shout out to Sade. Sade, I do. She's Nigerian. She is an Aquarius. You could be an Aquarius here for me to say that. My mom was an Aquarius. Aquarius are not emotional. <laughs> they are not emotional. My daughter was telling me her, um, one of her teachers in her classrooms you know, she, she works with two-year-olds with autism. And my daughter wants this teacher to, that's an Aquarius to be a little more loving and kind to the kids. But the Aquarius is like, nah, like, nah, I'm not trying to baby these kids. And my daughter is like, yeah, but they're babies. <laughs> like, legit, they're babies. They're two-year-olds, you know? And so I was like, oh, good. Good luck with that. I was like, you know, my daughter's a Taurus, so she's very loving. She's very kind. She's real sweet, empathetic. And this teacher isn't. And she was making me laugh. I was I was cracking up. I was like, yeah, I said, like, grandma, like, my mom was not very emotional, you know. I mean, she loved us. She showed us she loved us. She showed us she cared, but not very emotional at all. That's who this could be. Pile two or that's you. All right, pile two. Who is creeping and lurking on your shit? <laughs> Who is creeping on your shit? Give me three, please, Archangel Michael. Thank you. Hold on, let me clear out the energy from pile one. I've, I'm feeling like y'all are coming back from pile one. Mm, maybe y'all like coffee. I'm getting told some of y'all need a coffee. Maybe, maybe you need a cup. It's it's not too early. It's like 8 a.m. right now on Friday. If you want to get in for a Sunday reading, hit me up. Beautiful place tarot at gmail.com. I do take Cash App and Zelle. Um, yeah, $50 one hour face to face, either through Instagram or 10 questions pre recorded. Avenger, bottom of the deck, a warrior in the reverse. This person is very weak. This is a coward, pile two. This is a coward. This person has a God complex. Definitely you came from pile one. <clears throat> a mentor in the reverse. This person wants to be seen as like a Renaissance man or woman. Somebody who knows things, but they don't. They don't know things. Give me two more. Detective. Yeah, they're definitely stalking your shit. Look it. They're definitely stalking your shit. They're definitely looking at everything you post. What's she doing? This could be an athlete. They're telling me to take this. They could be an athlete. Give me one more spirit. Clarify for me. Mentor in the reverse. Do I want to clarify that? This is somebody, again, who has body dysmorphia could be a man who likes to work out or this could be you i don't know mentor give me one on mentor why is that in the reverse why is that in the shadow networker in the reverse this person is jealous of the fact that you have more followers i don't know why y'all get get so um Get so hung up on that shit, y'all. I've seen readers that ain't shit, that ain't good at all. Got 30,000 fucking subscribers. I'm like, come on, man. How you get 30K subscribers? It's just because they're constantly putting out content. Constantly. And then I see some readers that got 200 fucking subscribers and they're great fucking readers. 
and if y'all y'all see me you know i come to your channel as myself in the comments and i i bless y'all i give y'all cash apps i buy your decks i support this person is mad and upset because you got more followers they they do everything for clout here this lurker this fucking detective this is a nosy motherfucker they have a god complex they're a coward they're a legit coward watch my other video where i talk about lee hamlin lee hammock yeah he talks about like narcissists and that Lisa girl, how, how she talks about triangulation, because that's what I'm getting here. This could be heavy man, man energy, masculine. Passing on wisdom and refining a student's character, but this is the shadow. Inability to allow the student to move on to the role of master, imparting false instruction. So if this person has a child, they don't know how to teach the child how to drive. They don't know how to teach the child how to wash their ass. They're not a good parent here. I'm getting masculine energy here. All this motherfucker knows how to do is go to the gym. What I say about pile one? They know how to put up their little tripod and take their fucking pictures and their daisy dukes. Get the fuck out of here. I see it all the time at the gym. Bitch, I go in and I get out. I do what I gotta do and I go. Bitches like looking looking around. They like seeing who's checking them out. They like like doing stuff for the community, talking. I'd be like, shut the fuck up. Get off of that fucking machine. Can't stand that shit at the gym. I'd be like, ugh, I get so fucking annoyed. This person has a God complex. They think more highly of themselves than they ought to. Because like I said, they don't know how to teach anybody shit. They don't even know how to teach their own kid how to wipe their ass. yep that's who this is looking lurking on your shit and again i use the uh dracula bella lugosi thumbnail because i, I love 